Hello and welcome to another episode, or I guess we can call this part three, of Novice Kibitzing here. So, Garg said he challenged Zibit, so I figured, um, oh, Zibit, Zibit won't play. What? This, this doesn't seem right. Is Zibit on right now? Oh, Zibit doesn't want to play, oh no. Alrighty. That's unfortunate. Okay, so Zibit's Zibit's gonna play. This should be good. This should be good. Okay, let's do this. And we're playing or we're in a three O time control here. have no idea what this setup is called. Alrighty, what do we have here? Seems like these guys are, are pretty strong, so I imagine something like this is coming eventually. F6. Um, really, there's there's no other pawn break for black here. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not so sure about this at the moment. Th there's a potential sacrifice coming if this knight moves. This sacrifice on H6. Yeah, this is is tough. This is very tough. And then just something like Queen E1 is also probably on the cards or basically any idea getting the rook or the queen over to the to the H file is problematic. Okay, well this is just under attack here. Yeah. And if somebody comes here, you can just kind of sack sack a bunch of times. So, right. So if the knight moved and bishop took, then there was a queen queen grab here. Or queen grabbing uh, f7. I don't know if that was a finishing blow there, so that line may not actually work. Okay. Yeah, white. White just being relentless here. Black is kind of in a defensive shell. Okay, I mean, how does white even get in? Oh, I think he's just ready to sacrifice here. Probably even two pieces. Something like sack and then like... Yeah, probably sacking these bo <laughs> probably both of these pieces is on the cards. Just requires a bit of calculation to see if it actually works. Here comes the sack. Is it still more? Nope. 
because there's a night check. Yeah. That's uh that's rough. But can't Bishop take or right? Oh, F F six. I was expecting Rook D eight. Actually, allowing the queen trade. So basically, what that means is he's saying my attack is strong enough without queens on the board anyway. Possibly, possibly. Take the knight? No, because <laughs> Bishop was go was hitting this rook. But I think he could have taken the knight rook check if Bishop took very interesting. Oh, and for those who don't know, Zither has a great YouTube channel. Um, yeah, he's awesome. Actually, a lot of people have, have uh, come from Zibit's channel to mine, so I appreciate you guys for dropping by and giving my channel a, a watch. <laughs> but yeah, for those who don't know, he provides excellent commentary on uh, uh, whether he's providing coverage from his own streams or whether he's providing tournament coverage. Um, very good. Very good for um, all level players. Sound here? Jeez, this yeah, this this is just this is just too strong. Yeah, this this is almost probably resignable. This pawn chain is just way strong. Bishop A3, that's, that wins this pawn, and then it crumbles, like, like so, unless after Bishop takes, White just sacrifices the, yeah, it's, it's tough, 2800, good games by Zibit and Hikaru, I appreciate you guys uh, playing, so I could predict it. Alright, that'll do it for this episode of Novice Tradition, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.